What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of Sniper Ghost Warrior 3. So, um, if you checked out last episode, um, we did some upgrades on our gun here. But um, as you can see, it's changed a little bit more. The scope has changed, as well as we've got a camo, uh, which I decided to, uh, to get. But um, that's pretty much all the changes I have done, I believe. Yep, that's all the changes I have done. But uh, anyway, what we're going to do in this episode is we're going to continue um, the main story quest. And uh, um, I'm, I don't know what your reactions were to this game yet. Um, as of recording this, it's Thursday of, well, this video will be coming out Monday. So Thursday of last week, uh, obviously, um, I recorded this. So if you see this, well, I decided to continue it. If you didn't, well, you're not going to see it. I decided to discontinue the series. But anyway, let's uh, hook up the laptop. Right, so meet the team. Okay, so that's what we're going to go do then. Right, let's uh, head there. Let's do this. So, at the end of every episode, we have to return here anyway. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to do one mission per episode, I guess. And then that's the way it's going to work. If I decide to discontinue this series, then I will tell you and let you know. Let's enter. Let's get in this. Let's drive the slow ass car around, then, shall we? Looks like this, wherever this is, it's quite far away. Get to the tunnel. Alright. So, anyway. Uh, I hope everybody enjoyed last week's episode. Uh, let me know if you want me to continue doing this. If you don't, let me know. Um, if uh, you guys want me to stop making this series, what I will do is I will play this on, in my own time, really. I've got a few games what I am playing on my own time at the minute anyway. Like right now I'm playing a Tomb Raider, um, the latest one, because I never completed it. I bought it years ago, never completed it. So, yeah. In the process of doing that now. I wish this thing would go faster. This thing is slow as all hell. What does it go at? It goes at... About 80 kilometers an hour. Oh, okay, we're here. Okay, what's this way? What's going on here? Oh, and we've got a long ass load screen, so I will skip ahead of this uh, load screen, guys. Impressive work, Mr. North. What the? I've been tracking your movements. Excuse me? Okay, here. Out. Was that a joke? Alright guys, we are here. So it looks like we've uh, we've come to a new area. I have no idea where we are and how we get back or anything like that. Uh, I guess we're going here. So let's go there then. So the loading screens of this game do take an absolute age. They really do. And they're kind of a bit annoying. So it looks like the map isn't as small as I thought it was going to be, but that's alright. It's pretty cool. But the maps, well, they've got different maps for different things and stuff like that. So they did put a, quite a bit of work into this game. I give them that. The only thing they need to work on is the bloody load times. God damn. I think I just sat there for five minutes in that loading screen right there. You guys saw it, well, it was over and gone in a second for you guys, but... Uh, that was like a good, uh... 
a good five minutes. Now, oh. I might connect one to come out and play. <laughs> Alright, looks like this is our new base of operations here by the looks of it. Let's park here then. So I kind of picked the wrong camo. <laughs> Should be more of a snowy camo. Looks like there's a quick rappel here. There we go. I was hoping for him to grab on. Just pull out this. Alright, here we go. So if we don't act quickly... About damn time, John. John North. I'm pleased to finally meet you in the flesh. It's nice to finally put a face to the voice. Likewise, Mr. North. But you're more magnetic on the radio, to be honest. And you are? Lydia. Ex-Georgian SFB. Hmm. So, why are you helping us? Mr. Sims has brought me up to speed on your fight against the Separatists. I believe we can serve each other's interests. I'm looking for a man. He's a high-priority target for Mossad. Who? Dr. Sergei Flostov. If you help me locate him, I will assist you in your efforts against the Separatists. As well as in other... activities. You have yourself a deal. What's the plan, Frank? If we can eliminate the leadership of these cells while they're disorganized, they'll eventually collapse under their own weight. It's not a walk in the park, however. Thomas Sidamonica and Ina Zakarayan are the leaders of the two strongest separatist cells operating in Georgia. They're also about to be wed. If they manage to merge their forces, the separatists will become a real threat to the sitting government. So, we pop one of them and make it look like a setup? Let them take each other out after? You read my mind. JSOC has already signed off on neutralizing Sidamanitsa. But where? The wedding is being held in Kozori in two days' time. I grew up near Kozori. I could sketch a city map. Good. You go on ahead and find a spot to scope the target. I'm on it. It's a wedding, so make sure there's a clear line of sight of the church. I know I can trust you, Lydia. Keep an open comm channel. Got it. Tick tock. Of course, Mr. North. Alright, sweet. Alright, we'll pull out our uh, sniper rifle. So we've got like beds here and weapon caches, a workbench. Okay, so everything here is what was here, we need here, is here. That makes sense. Right, and also we've got a dock here to uh, to dock our PC on. Right, so let's um, dock the PC. <laughs> right, let's start this up. So meet the team, so we've done that. That's actually pretty cool. I like that uh, the picture there. Right, okay, so here we go. Let's start this up. Start up the mission. This wedding is going to be big. Everyone will be off their heads drunk or getting there. But you do need to blend in, John. Fuck blending in. I suggest you go as someone everyone will cheer. The driver of the delivery truck bringing in more wine. That's a bit balls out. Thank you. They buying your disguise, Lydia? You okay? Somewhat of a minor hero, actually. Dishonorable discharge from the Georgian army goes a long way here. So what exactly did you do? Put a general out of commission along with a dozen Georgian soldiers. Fucking looters and savages. The separatists don't know that, just my kill count. You'd do well to sell some cigarettes or oxy. Any pills you can get your hands on, Lydia. Everyone's got a side hustle going. War is good for business. And business is a great disguise. I'm doing just fine, Raquel. Thank you very much. I'll call when I need advice. So, the winery is a criminal enterprise. Of course. Criminal gangs are expanding rapidly. Everything is for sale. Politicians are in on it. Everyone... Excuse me, Raquel. Let's get back to it. Take out the guards, John. Find the keys and deliver the wine. Oh, and if you happen to stumble upon the gang leader, take him out. Got it. Out. All right. Right. On the spot. See the villa. Good. First you'll have to find the keys to the truck. How am I gonna do that? They could be anywhere. You tell me. You're the special ops guy here. Maybe ask one of those douchebags. Oh, and maybe you should drop that military look before you get to Kazori. 
I just got the information that the leader of that criminal group is in the winery right now. So if you're feeling somewhat heroic today, you could take him down while you're there. Does that help our cause? Not directly, but the workers will definitely appreciate the change in management. <laughs> Alright, okay, so we need to find the keys to the truck. What the hell's all of this? Alright. So we need to find the keys. The keys, the keys, the keys. Right, let's scope out the area. Figure out who's where and how and everything. And this little drone seems like it's... Uh, the frame rate's down on it. It's weird. Feels like I'm playing like a 30 FPS game, but the um the frame rate is next to nothing. Holy shit! There's loads of them. Right. Here's our new scope, anyway. Right, so what's the range on this guy? 88 meters? Alright. Right, there we go. Right, now we can pretty much just get in. And find somebody and uh, get a bit of interrogation going on. out of the pistol because uh, it's our best silenced uh, close quarters gun. Let's get inside of here and we'll interrogate somebody in here I think. Come here, you slut. What? No, keep your hands off. Stop fucking around and get... The keys to the wine delivery truck. Where are they? In one of the rooms on the top floor. Where can I find some spare clothes? Same floor, next room. Sorry, slut. Okay, that didn't go to plan. Don't shoot me. You there? Are you okay? Got the keys. Great. Got the keys. Now over there. A guy here. We'll take him out. A guy who came up the stairs was one of the guys we didn't spot. Bloody hell, these guys don't go down easily. Take clothes. Okay. I'm changed. Right. Find the truck. Got it. Right, first things first, let's start taking out some guys. Right, he's 
dead. And I'm almost out of pistol rounds. Great. Good night. Alright, we've got plenty of sniper rounds. The only thing is, is we need more pistol rounds. We've got two rounds left. Ugh. Right. Well, the only thing is, though, is there's a guy here. We'll take him out first. Right, he's down. Right, let's take down this guard over here. How far away is he? 100 and something. 150. Oh, shit. Right. We're good. Really what I want to do is I want to loot these guys and see if I can get some more pistol rounds. That's one thing we're going to have to do at the end of this is grab some more pistol rounds. Alright, let's just get in the truck. Got the truck. All right. Great. Now drive away to Kazori. No. Need to make a small detour first. What? Where to? The city's heavily guarded, remember? Need to hide my equipment. Or, or your cover will be compromised. Gotcha. All right. So first things first is we need to hide in our equipment, which is uh, cool. Right. So, so far, things have gone to plan and some haven't. So we need more pistol rounds. Whoa. So, load up on pistol rounds when we get back. Oh, there's the windmills there. Windmills or wind turbines? I believe the turbines. We're almost there. Over this uh, bridge here. Hide your equipment. Okay. I've hidden my equipment. I'll be in Kazori in a few minutes. Okay, we'll get back in the truck. So that means we're going to have to come back there anyway to get our equipment. Right. Okay, and we are here. Let's drive the truck in. 
Here we go. Truck's going sideways. Halt! What? Where are you going? What do you have here? Wine for the wedding? And I'm late, you see? Oh yeah, we were expecting the delivery. But we didn't expect it to be delivered by an American. Why is this? He seems to be telling the truth. There's a lot of wine in the truck. No sign of anything <laughs> suspicious. Mm. Okay, you can drive in. Okay, thank you. I'm here with the wine truck. Got it. Take a bottle and meet me in the restaurant. Okay, now we're going to a restaurant. Woohoo! Alright. In here. Uh, upstairs. Ah, here we are. Ah, uh, open. Hello. Groom arrived yet? The guy is first on the scene. I'm here to do a job. That doesn't mean talking. I thought we patched things over. I fucking waited for you. I'm a shithead. An asshole. A fucked up piece of scum. Right on all counts. I didn't deserve you. I couldn't... Oh, spare me. It's the truth. So you disappear? You leave me waiting like a lovesick fool? Twelve of my men died that night, Lydia. I remember every name, every face. My whole MEU. Soldiers died, John. We know the risks. It's not your fault. It was on my watch. Stop. I'm way too fucking mad to feel sorry for you. So they pin a medal on me to cover up that massive intel failure. It was a lie. It made everything about me a lie. How could I look anyone, you, in the face? I was going to ask you to marry me. Fuck you, John. I would have said yes. So the audio kept on jumping in and out there for me. I don't know what it was like for you guys. Hey, wake up. We have a job to do. Ah, shit. We overslept. The streets are probably already crawling with soldiers. You're here as a civilian, remember? They won't recognize you. Maybe... Oh, what an optimist. Either way, I'll still need a weapon to kill the target. And I doubt they'll give me one of theirs. Don't worry. I'm not gonna try to kill anyone in the middle of a church. It's best we strike tonight, while they're drunk and disorganized. Yep, sounds good. At least I'll be able to celebrate the wedding day there a little bit. Right, okay, so... Uh, get to the cemetery, okay. Oh, that curtain just spawned in. Excuse me, thank you. Coming through. Bloody wedding bells are going off. Hell of a dozen. Wedding must be a big thing. It's just political. Still, I can't hold the tears. Anna's dress is a bit unorthodox, to say the least. Looks like we're going in here. Here we go. Beloved, we are gathered together here in the sight of God and in the face of this company to join together this man and this woman in holy matrimony. For Georgia! Burn in hell, monster! Whoa, what? 
Come on, come on. Get your American ass out of here. But I... Shut up. I know a cave just south of here. Get out or be suspect number one. Okay, what the fuck? <laughs> act 2. Alright, we're now in Act 2. Sweet. Achievement. There's the corpse. Okay, I'm sending John. What the fuck happened? The body is in HQ. Just a few guards. Most of the separatists are gathered in the restaurant, where the cell leaders are busy accusing one another. Ina is gone. This should give us some time to investigate. We need to know who that other sniper was. Fuck. They're here. Persistent little fuckers. Half of yep. the city is looking for that motherfucker. We will find him sooner or later. What if there is more of them? I don't care how many people are responsible for this. I just want to find them and kill them. Seems clear to me. Yeah, I will. Do. All right, they're down. Nice. Just remember that we don't want to start an open war here. We can't afford to have civilians caught in the crossfire. Yeah, well, I won't make false promises. Not to you. That's sweet, but just be careful. Oh, holy hell is breaking out. Interrupt a wedding cause quite a ruckus. Yeah, groom's brains plat all over a church tends to do that. <clears throat> What's next, Chief? We're still untangling the encrypted satellite comms. Combing through for juicy details. Robert? Not yet. Fuck. There's a lot of separatist chatter about an elite unit operating in the area. Lots of warnings to avoid getting in their way. I've heard a few nervous whispers. No one seems to know their objective. They're like ghosts, inspiring terror and then vanishing again. We've only got one name. A mystery man named Armazi. Spoken of rarely and only with dread. <laughs> like the guy has superpowers. Robert was captured by an elite unit. Could these guys be connected? God, I hope not. They're the worst of the worst. Fuck. Yeah. Out. Okay, I was just making sure this thing is silenced. This is a different gun as well, what we've got here. Oh shit. Okay, let's loot this. Loot this guy. Down. What else can I expect in the HQ? If they manage to make any notes on the assassination, it should be on one of their hard drives. Got it. <laughs> Grab, uh... Alright, we'll loot them. And then we'll grab him. I'll just move him here slightly. Just so he's out the way. Right. There we go. I'm inside. The body should be in the basement lab. Only So I'm thinking mine. Couple hundred to do. I'll talk with Aslane. His team is familiar with the area. Great. Now, the northern part is presenting a bigger problem. We'll need ground patrols and at least two vehicles. There's no other option. Okay, so we could have just come in through that.
I see. Anything peculiar? The bullet nearly ripped his head off. Fifty cal? Maybe. I won't learn much here. Okay, there's uh, loot here. I've got the ballistic report. Let's see if there's any more gear around here. No, the northern part is presenting a bigger problem. We only need ground patrols and at least two vehicles. There's no other option. True, Lord. Seriously? See if we can take out both of these guys. Take out the big heavy guy first. We need a medic. That was pretty uh, straightforward. Move him. Oh, let's analyze. It doesn't look like we can grab any of these, so I'm guessing... Upstairs. It's the last or final place. Guessing the last piece of evidence has got to be around here somewhere. Where's this last piece of evidence? That is my question. I think I've checked every floor now. So we've got two of three. I analyzed that, but I don't think it maybe it's worked. Okay, we've got that. All right, we got him. Ah, here we go. Didn't use this one. I found autopsy That's it. Get back. No. One more stop. I want to check the church. <laughs> We're in moment for conversion, but suit yourself. Right. OK, 
Okay. So now we're going to have a nice stroll to the church. Right, there we go. We snuck past him. Keep a bit of a wide berth on this place so uh, they don't see us. According to the documents from the autopsy, the bullet was strange and deformed. Strange how? No details. Shots nearby! Okay, this ain't going to plan. Alright, we're dead. I was hoping to shoot the one dude in the head and then hopefully the bullet would go through him and then into his friend, but when I shot the bullet, it must have missed them. It must have missed them both. It must have went just in between them. Which kind of sucked. That's alright. Alright, let's figure out where we are and where this checkpoint is. Alright, so all we have to do is get back to the church. That's fine. Easy enough. Right, let's make it to the church. Right, how many uh, bullets do we have for this? Okay, so we have five. Okay. And there's two guys there. One there and one there. Okay, he's got the back to him as well. Right, how far away is he? 69 meters. Don't really need that then. Shit, I think there's another guy there. What? According to the documents from the autopsy, where'd he go? The bullet was strange and ah, there he is. Strange how. Okay, we're good. Looks like our silence has gone here on our pistol. Right, uh, now how do we... Um, I can't remember what the thing is to bring up the suppressor repair thing. Right, what's this? Is this something we can take? Looks like it is. It's collectible. Right, let's just grab ammo. Or whatever we can here. Right, um, question is, how the hell do we bring up the suppressor repair thing? I'm sure we had two, or bought two. 
might not have them on this uh, guy though, which sucks. Grab loot. Alright, let's go in here then. Nope, doesn't look like we're going through this door. Looks like this is the only gun with the suppressor on it right now. Let's see if we can get in here. Yeah, here we go. There's a bullet hole in the floor. What the is this? The bullet hit him like a sledgehammer. Threw him all the way here. I found a fresh hole in the wall. Two inches thick. That's crazy. Do you know a bullet that could do that? Some 50 cals could. Or maybe Teflon bullets. It had to be a damn good rifle. Okay, we're good. What can you see outside? Fields, hills, forest, ruins. At least Up a there. dozen decent sniping spots. Okay. If I were to take a shot like that, I'd choose this ruined church on the hill. Shit. I already know how this went. I'm going to the church. <sighs> Go on then. Alright, looks like we're going up there. Right, let's get in this car then. Let's go. Alright, let's go. This is going to be a long episode. Holy crap. I just realized how long I've been recording for, but then I've just got to remember, oh yeah, there's about like 10 minutes worth of loading screens to edit out. Alright, okay. So sorry if I'm being a bit too quiet, guys. It's uh, I'm just concentrating here a little bit. Yep, that's where I would snipe from us up there. Keep me informed. I want my gear back though. That's what I want. I want my gun back, I want everything back. Right, I'm betting there's nobody up here, hopefully. If there is, we're gonna have to shoot a few of them. Bloody hell, it's a long way up. <laughs> Can we get up here? No, I'm guessing not. We're gonna have to take up another way. This way, I'm guessing. That's a long way up. God damn. I think we've got our optional though, don't raise any alarms. There we go. I'm at the church on the hill. Look around carefully. If this really was his sniping spot, then he must have left something. Anything. I've been doing this my whole life. Trust me, I know what to do. Analyze footprints. I'll hurry up, don't worry.
Right, I see the footprints, right? It's like I have to be here. New clue, where? Oh, over there. Somewhere around here? <coughs> ah, we can go up here. I'm guessing this here is a sniper nest right here. I found the casing. And? Never seen anything like it. I think he left it here on purpose. He took the shot from this spot. Yep, right here. Rifle he must have. Clearly a pro. How do you know? He must have been here at least seven hours, laying on the ground, waiting. No trace of piss or excrement. Nothing. He's special ops, but luckily I found a trail. I'm going after him. Negative. Separatists are on their way. There's no time. I'm going, Lydia. Ah, so it looks like he came down here. Came down <coughs> here. And then dropped down here. And then went this way. Oh, imagine if it's our brother. I have a feeling it might be somehow. Mines. Tutorial. So watch out for mines. Use scout mode to spot mines. Um, d um disarm mines with this while. Okay. There's a mine here. Mine there. Right, so I'm gonna stay in scout mode here so I can see the mines. Oh, here we go. Load screen. Or whatever. Okay. I see a glint. Reflection. Package on a tombstone. Careful. Bomb. Roundish. Odd. Shit, what it's a helmet. I. I think. What? A helmet is a helmet. Amazing technology. Not sure how it works. Get out of there. Whoa. If you wanted me dead, I would be. Dugout. It's a message. The ghost is real, Lydia. And steps ahead of us. All right. Where are you hiding, brother? And that wasn't that hard. See you picked up some new tricks. You give up? Not today. Nope. Oh man, how did you even
fine. Walk straight into a trap, but I'm fine. You need to get out. The Separatists are coming. I'm on my way. Alright, walk in between those. Alright, nicely just jump down here. And we're out of there. Alright, there we go. So, uh, sniper of accuracy was 100%, 13 headshots, uh, longest distance was uh, 76 meters. So, yeah, we actually did okay. So, the name on the helmet is Amazi, and some damn super sniper shoots it out of my hands. It makes no fucking sense. JSOC is still trying to get a handle on him. All I know is that whispers of this Amazi guy has grown into this crazy urban legend. Some people say he's a part machine. Some say he's like the reincarnation of the ancient pagan god, Mithras. Ah, bullshit. He may be extraordinarily well trained, but he's a soldier. Just using ultra high tech weaponry is all. I've collected one of his bullets. Nothing I've ever seen before. I got a guy. Glad to hear it. Shut up. A guy who specializes in out of the ordinary weaponry. Experimental, cutting edge stuff. I'll show it to him. See what he has to say. Much appreciated. He hasn't been seen in a while. He tends to disappear like fucking asshole men do. Okay, Lydia. Can you track him down? <laughs> I've got an idea or two. Out. Alright guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to end this one here. I hope you guys have enjoyed. What we're going to do is we are going to fast travel back uh, to here. So yeah, the freaking super sniper just decided to shoot it out of our hands. Like, holy crap, that guy's a good shot. Like, a very good shot. Because obviously you've got to take in windage and all kinds of other stuff, and he hit that perfectly. Right, so what we are going to do is I am going to put on my, um, back on our old stuff. But I'll show you guys that in the next episode. But anyway, guys, I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you want me to continue this series, let me know in the comments below. If you don't, let me know as well. Uh, hit the like button if you liked it. If you didn't, hit the dislike button. And uh, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And I will see you guys uh, in the next episode, which will be uh, tomorrow. If uh, I decide to continue this, which I am for now, anyway. But anyway, guys, I'll see you then. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing, Parker?